All right, welcome back to Old Man Tech. Today we're going to show you how to set up libraries in uh, in Kodi. Um, great way to keep up all the, with all the latest episodes of your TV shows that you um, that you watch. Uh, you can show it right there on the home screen. You just see the recently added videos, and there they are. Or not videos, but TV shows, or even uh, movies for that matter. Let's go ahead and set that up. Really, really simple to set up. Uh, we want to go to our video section and our add-ons. You want to find the source. There's uh, we're going to use Salts for this because out of the ones I have installed, this is the only one that really supports libraries. Genesis does too, but it's going away. It's not updating, so we're going to stick with Salts. There are other add-ons that uh, that support libraries. Just look it up if you want to, you know, look it up and install if you want to use something else. But Salts is good for me, so I'll go ahead and go into Salts. And let's go into TV shows. Let's go into uh, trending TV shows, see what's going on here. We're going to try to find something that there's only a few seasons, because um, setting this up the first time, it does take a little bit to download all the information from the episodes, and I don't want to sit here and waste all your time. So let's go, uh, this one says 2015, so let's go ahead and go into that. Yeah, it's only two seasons. So let's go ahead and go back to it, go ahead and find it. We're going to right-click on that, right? Right-click and say Add to our library. So you should see here in the bottom right, there it is. It added it, added the source to our library. Let's find one more uh, just to keep, just to uh, show you another example of the expanse. That looks pretty cool. Let's go ahead and right click on that and say add to library. All right, it added that one. Let's go back to the home screen. As you can see, there's nothing new up here. There's no extra um, menu items or anything like that to show you, you know, where they are. But let's go ahead and add that. Mm, excuse me. So this time we're going to go to files. I'm sorry, videos and files. Click that. Um, whoop, let's go back out of this where we were last. Let's go back up, 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 up. All right. Boom. There we go. To it shows files. We want to click on files. We want to add videos to our to that file. And we're going to browse for the source that's providing the information for those shows. Right. So let's go ahead and go to home folder. This is where it's, um, where Cody stores all the information. Go back to the home folder. And go to user data. That way, it's my you know my information. Go to add-on data, and here's the different sources. Salts is the one we're using. Stream all the sources. Um, that's the one I'm using. Of course, if you're using something else, Genesis or whatever, pick that one. I'm going to pick Salts. And in TV shows, so let's go ahead and click TV shows. As you can see, it does have the two shows that we added. Don't select any of those. Make sure you are in the down here in the bottom. You can see the TV shows folder. Um, click that. There we go. And name it whatever you want to name it. I'm going to keep it TV shows. Makes sense to me. Right? Say OK. Now we're going to use a, uh, we have to select which scraper to use. If it's a movie, you want to pick movies. If it's music, pick music. TV shows, TV shows. Right? Really simple. Let's go ahead and uh, hit the little thing here until we find it. There we go. TV shows is going to be using the TV DB um, scraper. So let's go ahead and hit OK. It's going to ask if we want to refresh the information, which we do the first time. Yes, of course. We want to, have to go out there and find the information for the shows we just added. So we say yes. And it's going to take just a minute. Like I said, if it, uh, and you can see at the top there, it is adding information. Um, if this is something that has 10, 12 seasons, it, this might take a while, but this is just the first time. And then I think you can set it up for however often you want it to um, scan your libraries. Um, but once a week, once every day, whatever. Um, but when the new ones show up, you will see the newest episodes. As you can see, it is done. Let's go ahead and go to home. You will see, there you go, there's the new folder it created, or the new menu item it created, TV shows. And if you see up at the top, there's the new, uh, the recently added episodes. Now, um, next week or next couple days, when there's a new episode for that show, you will see the latest episode, episode there on that list up here at the top. So yeah, very, very cool. You can also go into this menu here, menu item here, and you can see the two shows that we added. You can actually go into it and see all the episodes and play them from here. Or like I said, you can go straight from here, see that and see the latest episodes. So very, very nice. Do the same thing for uh, for movies. Let's go ahead and do that. Just to show it again, show you how to do it. Go to videos and add-ons to select what uh, movies you want. Again, let's pick, up, pick salts because that's the um, add-on that supports libraries let's go to movies let's grab uh, let's grab two movies it doesn't matter what um, Martian sure right click on it say add to library see there in the bottom it should add it boom let's pick bridge of spies saw it last night great uh, great movie by the way add to libraries and there you go so now it's added two movies to 
uh, the libraries. As you, as you can see, there's no new menu items, so let's go ahead and add one. Go to Videos and Files, and we're going to add videos. We're going to go to Browse again. We're going to go to Home Folder, User Data, Add-on Data. Find that uh, that add-on, which there it is, Salts. That's what we're using. This time we're going to go into Movies. Um, Oh, I think I added these earlier on playing around. But anyway, here's here's five different movies. Click OK. I'll call it whatever you want. I'm going to call it movies. And again, we have to pick the scraper that uh, is right for... I didn't do it right, but that's okay. Let's go back up here and say uh, edit source, right? I did that. Say OK. Go back here. I accidentally clicked out of it. Accidentally right click. So anyway, we want to pick movies. Say OK. And again, it's going to scan to get the information for those movies. I think it had five, right? All right, let's go back out of there. Let's go to movies. Well, okay, so it's just doing the two. I don't know why those other ones are in there. But uh, anyway, um, there's the movies. There's the two that we put up in here. Really, really nice. Um, say, say, okay, say we watch one of these movies. Say, like, like last night, I watched Bridge of Spies. So I don't want it in my list of movies anymore. We want to get it out of there. Really, really easy to do. Okay, go into Movies. Here is the movie that we want to remove from our list. Right-click on it. This time we're going to go to Manage. And in there, we want to remove it from the library. Click there. Say, uh, you want to remove that? Yes, I want to remove it. It's going to remove all the information. Is that okay? Yes, it's okay. See, so now it's out of our list. So now we go back over here to Movies. The only one that's shown is that one. Again, if we want to add one more, let's add another movie real quick. Um, videos, add-ons, salts, movies. Let's add a different movie. Let's add, let's see, popular movies. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, da -da 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 -da. let's grab, um, here we go, Lord of the Rings. Right-click on it, say add to library. Should say down here in the bottom. Eventually, there it is. It added it. So now we can go back up to our main menu and movies. Oh, see? But it didn't add it because it didn't update it because we didn't have it scanned to update. All right? Let's go here and go update library. Just add it to the list. See that there? Hit home under movies. There it is. So there's our two videos now. See, so really easy to add things and remove them. So uh, yeah, let's see. Uh, any other questions? Please let me know. Uh, really, really cool feature. This library's feature. Especially for TV shows, it keeps up with the latest ones. Of course, when you first do it, it's going to show every episode up here, basically. You know, it's going to show everything. Um, but as new episodes come out, it will be the first, you know, the first video. So you have 10 different um, TV, sh TV shows you keep up with. It'll have the latest episode of each one here in a row here. Really, really nice. So, all right, thanks for watching. Peace.